I am just so ready for this video. Like, got the tree up, got my Christmas pajamas on, and my socks. It's just a good day. It's the greatest time of year. So uh, today I'm doing the Tis the Season tag, and this is a tag that was created by Laguna Beach Love 10 and Mac Angel 03. So um, I thought this would be really cool. I've seen a couple of these floating around YouTube already, and I love that it's already going to be Christmas in 25 days. I'm recording this on the 1st of December, so yay, I already got my tree up. That's what I did all day. Well, not all day, but majority of the day. So before I jump into the tag, I thought I'd talk to you guys just a little bit. Uh, first of all, I'd like to say that I'm so sorry I haven't been posting videos. As you can probably tell, I'm not a very frequent video maker and stuff. I've had a lot of difficulties with my camera and with my computer and getting everything to work together, so it's been kind of crazy, but hopefully things will start to get better. If not, just stay, stay tuned. You guys have been so patient with me, so I hope that that continues if problems continue to happen. And another thing, because I am very unfrequent with making videos, I thought I would make a Instagram and a Twitter account for my channel specifically uh, because I'm always on Twitter and Instagram so I thought that this would be a way for you guys to still connect with me even if I'm not posting videos so the links will be down below but both of the names are Hannah underscore MBP which stands for Music Beauty Passion so if you guys want to go Look that up and follow me on Instagram and Twitter. That'd be awesome. You guys can keep up on my life a bit more because I'm on that every day. So if I'm not posting a video that day, you guys can see what's up there. So go check that out. But without further ado, let's get started with the tag. So the first one is your top two winter beauty essentials. So for my first winter beauty essential, I chose... These two things, they are both moisturization products, so that's the one thing, the moisturization. Um, this is one of my EOS lip balms. It's the Vanilla Wonderland, I think that's what it's called. Um, it's from the Alice in Wonderland collection. Just a good lip balm that'll keep your lips moisturized, I think is really important because the air tends to get more dry in the winter time, and along with keeping your lips moisturized, also a good face cream is really important to have because it'll just keep your skin looking fresh and I use the Neutrogena Naturals multivitamin nourishing night cream you don't have to use a night cream but this is what I use every day it's super moisturizing and a little goes a long way so this little thing will last me for a really long time and it also smells really good so this is just really nice to have especially in the winter and then my second beauty product for and then my second beauty essential is another two-in-one, but just a highlighting product. I think that highlighting your skin in the wintertime keeps it looking fresh. So I have two different options. One is one of my cream highlighters. This is the little mini version of the Fresh Twilight Glow Highlighter. And then I also have a powder highlighter from Maybelline, and this is in the shade Ray of Gold, and it's just... Um, a powder highlighter but both of these work really good and keep your skin looking very golden and like fresh in the winter time next are your top two fashion essentials so my first one is just a basic cable knit sweater uh, any thick knit sweaters I think are really important to have in the winter time because they'll keep you really warm and you can dress them up or dress them down and they're just really easy to style and then my next fashion essential is just any scarfs that'll keep you warm uh, these are my two favorite winter ones so any just any scarfs that'll keep your neck warm uh, obviously are awesome and if they look cute too that's always a plus so just scarves in general the next question is what shoes do you tend to wear most in the winter time so the shoes that I tend to wear most are probably not the most practical but they are the ones I tend to wear the most in the winter they are my UGG boots. Um, I'm not sure of the specific name of these. They might be like the the knit Bailey button maybe. I don't know. Um, I'll find a link to the UGG website where I got these um, and link that down below but these are the ones that I wear. They're just gray wool Uggs and they keep me really warm. And I've had these for a couple years and they're still in pretty good condition so these things are 
pretty much my life in the winter time. Next is your favorite winter accessory. And again, I chose a couple because I can never decide because I wear these all so much in the winter. But the first one is just this beanie that I got at Walgreens, actually. Just any gray or any color beanies that are floppy because I think these look really cute just sitting on the back of your head. And along with these, I also like the beret kind of hats um, that are more round than like elongated so these are really nice and then also with that I have a newfound love for these little headbands that sit around your head and they're like a substitute for ear warmers or anything like that or earmuffs and they just it's like a headband that goes around your head like that I'm not gonna put it on now and they're all pretty thick and they keep my ears and my head warm which is important especially in the winter and then for my favorite nail polish for the winter time, it is definitely this color by Essie, and it's in the shade Aruba Blue, and it's just this really pretty royal blue color. Um, I love this because I think that it's just really nice, and it just kind of reminds me of, like, snow and stuff, even though snow's white. I don't know. I just really like this color, and I think it's really good for the winter time. Question number six is hot cocoa or apple cider. I love them both so much, but I think in the winter time, I'm more of a hot cocoa person because apple cider is what I tend to drink in the fall, but they're both so yummy, but I think that hot cocoa is definitely what I drink more in the Christmas and holiday time. Number seven is your favorite winter candle. Mine's already in my little tin. Look at this. My favorite winter candle is from Bath & Body Works, and it is the Fresh Balsam Candle. I got this in the fall, and I think that they have a scent that is very similar, if not the same scent out in their winter collection, and I think it's called Evergreen. But this is what I got a couple months ago, and it literally smells like a pine tree, and my tree is fake, so... It doesn't smell like a pine tree, and like a legit Christmas tree. So I burned this, and it smells so good, and it just makes my makes my room smell like a Christmas tree, and I love it. And I also have this little container thing that has snowflakes on it, so it's so festive. And I put it in there, and it sits happily next to my tree and burns and makes my room smell like a winter wonderland with trees. So it's perfect. Question number eight is snowboarding or skiing. Uh, I think that personally... I would choose snowboarding. I've done both, um, and I'm not good at either, but I think that snowboarding, if I could pick out of the two, I'd rather learn how to snowboard than I would to ski, just because I think that it looks cooler, which is so stupid, but it's true. Like, that's what I would think, so. Snowboarding. Number nine is, have you ever gone ice skating? Are you good, or do you fail miserably? Um, I have gone ice skating a few times. I tend to go every year, even though... I do fail miserably. Um, it's something I'm working on. Uh, I also suck at roller skating, so I guess that that kind of goes hand in hand because one's on ice and one's not. But yeah, I'm going to try to get better because my friends like to do that kind of stuff. So it's something that I'm working on. So as of now, I fail miserably, but maybe next year I'll be good. <laughs> the next question is, does it snow where you live? It snows a ton where I live. Um, I'm from Chicago actually and so it does tend to snow a lot actually. Uh, it's pretty crazy. Sometimes it doesn't snow at all. Um, we always tend to have a lot of snow like the week before Christmas and then like a ton after which sucks because I would rather have it before and then be done with it after Christmas because once Christmas is over I'm just done with everything. But um, yeah it snows a lot where I'm from and Chicago gets some pretty intense snowstorm. We haven't had any yet, so I guess we'll see how it does this year. Question number 11 is, have you ever made a snowman? I make snowmen every year. Me and my friends are kind of cheesy, and we, uh, we always make snowmen, and yeah, we go sledding, and we just kind of have like a snow day, um, and we just go all out, snowball fight, all this, all this stuff, so yes, I have. What holiday do you celebrate? I celebrate Christmas, as you might be able to tell, with my beautiful Christmas tree. No, just kidding. Um, but yeah, I do celebrate Christmas. I've always celebrated Christmas, and I love it. So, yeah. Favorite Christmas or holiday song? Um, the song that's my favorite really isn't, like, it's kind of lame. Uh, it's not like a song that I would, like, jam out to in the car or anything, but it is actually the main title from Home Alone, the movie. Um, it's kind of lame, I know, but, um, it's just really, like, 
pretty. I don't know. I just really like it. And if you guys want to check it out, I'll have it in the down bar along with everything else. But it's just very pretty and it's just like a magical song to me. And I watch Home Alone every year. So it just kind of like reoccurs. And when I hear it, my heart just melts. And I'm just like, oh, Christmas. So yeah, that's my favorite song. Favorite Christmas or holiday movie? Um, I pretty much just answered it. Home Alone. And then of course, along with everyone else that's going to answer this question, Elf. Who else? What? What else? What is your favorite winter treat? Um, my favorite winter treat, well, my favorite winter drink treat is eggnog all the way. Love eggnog. I used to hate it. It's my favorite thing in the world now. And then my, like, edible, like, I can actually eat it, peppermint bark. Wow. Those are just my favorite things. I could just eat those all day. Would be the most unhealthy thing, but it's delicious. Could do it. If you were to ask Santa for one thing and you were guaranteed to get it, what would it be? Um, if it was like unmaterialistic, I would say that I am sure that my family is going to be safe and that my friends are going to be safe and that everything's just good and we all stay healthy and safe and out of harm's way and world peace. Um, but if it was going to be something like a gift that Santa could get me, it would either be a car, because I'm going to get my license soon, or Louis Vuitton Speedy 30, because that's something that I've lusted over forever, and I think it's so cute and just it's just so perfect, but I would never buy it for myself, and it's so expensive that I would never ask my family or any of my friends to buy it for me. But if Santa was going to give it to me for free, A, why not? And then the last question is, do you have anything fun planned for this winter? I have a ton of stuff planned for the winter. To Millennium Park and shop around and go window shopping. And I think we're going to go on one of those carriage rides this year, which is really cool. And then along with that, I'm seeing a musical with my friend and her family, which I'm so excited about. And also with that, just like spending time with my family and friends on break and um, going to parties and stuff. So yeah, I have a lot of stuff planned for the winter. And of course, I have a ton of videos planned for the winter, so stay tuned to that. This has been my Tis the Season tag. I'll have the people I tag to do this video in the description box. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it was fun for me, and I hope that it got you guys into the holiday spirit. If you like this video or any of my other videos, it would mean the world to me. If you would subscribe, it's free, I promise, and then you can keep up with me. And don't forget to check out my Twitter and my Instagram pages because I am on those constantly, so you guys can keep up with me. And overall, I hope you guys are having an awesome day, and thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!